tend to use the martial art which was founded by This martial art was is called Aikido. It was defined by uh, many instructors on different levels. But the founder himself, Hussein Sein Morehi Yoshiba, have defined Aikido in essence as the art of peace. Now in the art of peace, uh, I would like to that Yoshiba in his Art of Peace number 50 have already uh, given the general concept of Aikido as a non-resistance in some events. Since it is non-resistance, it is very victorious from the very beginning because it contains the nothing. of Aikido is categorized only into two. We call this in Japanese as Irimi and Tenkan. When we say Irimi, it is a linear motion or a straight motion. While the Japanese Tenkan means circular or pivotal motion. This time, it doesn't matter whether you disarm the knife or any weapon that the enemy is holding. What is most important is you always move out from the target point. By following the three principles and using just the two steps or two motions or two movements which is Irimi and Tenkan. Here, if example, the opponent cannot immediately disarm me as long as you move out from the target point. Like here, that is moving out. The target point is here, they move it out. Up my side, up my back. Here, oh. oh. Here, oh. Here, oh. Three general principles, which is uh, follow the force, evade the force, and neutralize the force. And then there are additional three again ways how to neutralize the opponent which is you may either lock, break or throw in the downward attack this is assuming this is a knife in the downward attack i will is explain the three principles which i have just said motion one here first i went out i evade the force evade the force is downward so i will follow the force the downward force only in a circular motion, break or throw to neutralize the body. If we do it faster, this is like this. First, throw. See, that is Ikkyo. And then I will disarm or dislodge the knife before freeing the opponent. The same is true with a straight attack. In a straight attack, I always follow the three principles. This is evasion. Second, follow the force. And third, I will either break this one, lock or throw. Okay. Yeah. As I have already said, I will always disarm the knife before the opponent. Now, in the circular motion, the same principle follows. Circular, here, follow the ball. And then slowly throw. So if we do it a little bit faster, 
Upward, the same principle follow. In the upward strike, always evade. After evasion, you hold here, and then this is what we call a uh, reverse Yuhonagi technique. Down, here. And then if he turns back, he turns like that, here. Convert it here. Okay, and then his arm be the opponent. Okay. Uh, reverse. So this is upward. Now we go to reverse. Uh, reverse inward. Reverse here. Also, I will not go against. I will not go against you. But I will follow the circular motion. Here. Yes. Okay. As I have said, the same principle follows always the slug the knife before free. Inside or outside. We call this outside the body, we call this inside. This time I will go outside the body. That is a frontal attack. Roundhouse kick, the same I will follow with this force. This is a circular force, so I will not go against. I will not do like that. Otherwise, I will absorb his whole strength. So all I have to do is to follow the force. Yeah. Okay. I will repeat here. Yes. Here. See? So, already pin down the opponent. If he is hurt during the throw, that is just enough to neutralize him or to prevent him from delivering a further attack. Or, you just do like that. Okay. <laughs> when we follow the three principles, what we will do is to always capitalize on the strength of the opponent to his own defeat. In this case, I will apply a Shihu Nagi technique. Here. Faster here. Oops. 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 Then here. Always. There are many techniques applicable to this. We can also use the Sodori technique. Sodori break. This is breaking. Here. I am holding this one to prevent him from punching me. Here, oh, see, and then I will apply it throw. Here, oops, then always, always, this lads 